Psalm 7 verses 1 to 17 KJV, Shigayan of David, which he sang unto the Lord, concerning the words of Cush the Benjamite. O Lord my God, in thee do I put my trust, save me from all them that persecute me, and deliver me, lest he tear my soul like a lion, rending it in pieces, while there is none to deliver. O Lord my God, if I have done this, if there be iniquity in my hands, if I have rewarded evil unto him that was at peace with me, yeah, I have delivered him that without cause is mine enemy. Let the enemy persecute my soul, and take it, yeah, let him tread down my life upon the earth, and lay mine honor in the dust. Selah. Arise, O Lord, in thine anger, lift up thyself because of the rage of mine enemies, and awake for me to the judgment that thou hast commanded. So shall the congregation of the people compass thee about, for their sakes therefore return thou on high. The Lord shall judge the people, judge me, O Lord, according to my righteousness, and according to mine integrity that is in me. O let the wickedness of the wicked come to an end, but establish the just, for the righteous God trieth the hearts and reigns. My defense is of God, which salveth the upright in heart. God judgeth the righteous, and God is angry with the wicked every day. If he turn not, he will wet his sword, he hath bent his bow, and made it ready. He hath also prepared for him the instruments of death, he ordaineth his arrows against the persecutors. Behold, he traveleth with iniquity, and hath conceived mischief, and brought forth falsehood. He made a pit, and digged it, and is fallen into the ditch which he made. His mischief shall return upon his own head, and his violent dealing shall come down upon his own pate. I will praise the Lord according to his righteousness, and will sing praise to the name of the Lord Most High. Psalm 8 verses 1 to 9 KJV, to the chief musician upon Giddith, a psalm of David. O Lord our Lord, how excellent is thy name in all the earth! Who hast set thy glory above the heavens! Out of the mouth of babes and sucklings hast thou ordained strength because of thine enemies, that thou mightest still the enemy and the avenger. When I consider thy heavens, the work of thy fingers, the moon and the stars, which thou hast ordained, what is man, that thou art mindful of him? And the son of man, that thou visitest him? For thou hast made him a little lower than the angels, and hast crowned him with glory and honor. Thou madest him to have dominion over the works of thy hands, thou hast put all things under his feet, all sheep and oxen, yea, and the beasts of the field, the fowl of the air, and the fish of the sea, and whatsoever passeth through the paths of the seas. O Lord our Lord, how excellent is thy name in all the earth! Psalm 9 verses 1 to 20 KJV, to the chief musician upon Muthlaban, a psalm of David. I will praise thee, O Lord, with my whole heart, I will shew forth all thy marvelous works. I will be glad and rejoice in thee, I will sing praise to thy name, O thou Most High. When mine enemies are turned back, they shall fall and perish at thy presence. For thou hast maintained my right and my cause, thou satest in the throne judging right. Thou hast rebuked the heathen, thou hast destroyed the wicked, Thou hast put out their name for ever and ever. O thou enemy, destructions are come to a perpetual end, and thou hast destroyed cities, their memorial is perished with them. But the Lord shall endure for ever, he hath prepared his throne for judgment. And he shall judge the world in righteousness, he shall minister judgment to the people in uprightness. The Lord also will be a refuge for the oppressed, a refuge in times of trouble. And they that know thy name will put their trust in thee, for thou, Lord, hast not forsaken them that seek thee. Sing praises to the Lord, which dwelleth in Zion, declare among the people his doings. When he mocketh inquisition for blood, he remembereth them, he forgetteth not the cry of the humble. Have mercy upon me, O Lord, consider my trouble which I suffer of them that hate me, thou that liftest me up from the gates of death that I may shew forth all thy praise in the gates of the daughter of Zion, I will rejoice in thy salvation. The heathen are sunk down in the pit that they made, in the net which they hid is their own foot taken. The Lord is known by the judgment which he executeth, the wicked is snared in the work of his own hands. Hagain. 
Selah. The wicked shall be turned into hell, and all the nations that forget God. For the needy shall not always be forgotten, the expectation of the poor shall not perish forever. Arise, O Lord, let not man prevail, let the heathen be judged in thy sight. Put them in fear, O Lord, that the nations may know themselves to be but men. Selah. Psalm 10 verses 1 to 18 KJV. Why standest thou afar off, O Lord? Why hidest thou thyself in times of trouble? The wicked in his pride doth persecute the poor, let them be taken in the devices that they have imagined. For the wicked boasteth of his heart's desire, and blesseth the covetous, whom the Lord abhorreth. The wicked, through the pride of his countenance, will not seek after God, God is not in all his thoughts. His ways are always grievous, thy judgments are far above out of his sight, as for all his enemies, he puffeth at them. He hath said in his heart, I shall not be moved, for I shall never be in adversity. His mouth is full of cursing and deceit and fraud, under his tongue is mischief and vanity. He sitteth in the lurking places of the villages, in the secret places doth he murder the innocent, his eyes are privily set against the poor. He leath and wait secretly as a lion in his den, he leath and wait to catch the poor, he doth catch the poor, when he draweth him into his net. He croucheth and humbleth himself, that the poor may fall by his strong ones. He hath said in his heart, God hath forgotten, he hideth his face, he will never see it. Arise, O Lord, O God, lift up thine hand, forget not the humble. Wherefore doth the wicked contemn God? He hath said in his heart, Thou wilt not require it. Thou hast seen it, for thou beholdest mischief and spite, to requite it with thy hand, the poor committeth himself unto thee, thou art the helper of the fatherless. Break thou the arm of the wicked and the evil man, seek out his wickedness till thou find none. The Lord is king for ever and ever, the heathen are perished out of his land. Lord, thou hast heard the desire of the humble, Thou wilt prepare their heart, thou wilt cause thine ear to hear, to judge the fatherless and the oppressed, that the man of the earth may no more oppress. Psalm 11 verses 1 to 7 KJV, to the chief musician, a psalm of David. In the Lord put I my trust, how say ye to my soul, flee as a bird to your mountain. For, lo, the wicked bend their bow, they make ready their arrow upon the string, that they may privily shoot at the upright in heart. If the foundations be destroyed, what can the righteous do? The Lord is in his holy temple, the Lord's throne is in heaven, his eyes behold, his eyelids try, the children of men. The Lord trieth the righteous, but the wicked and him that loveth violence his soul hateth. Upon the wicked he shall rain snares, fire and brimstone, and an horrible tempest, this shall be the portion of their cup. For the righteous Lord loveth righteousness, his countenance doth behold the upright.